everybody and welcome to this video where we're going to talk about something nobody wants to talk about except me because I have questions and I hope that you have answers because I don't have any. So here's the deal. Ever since Trump said he was going to run for office, I'm pretty sure. So this is back in like 20 forever ago. There have been books written by people close to him or people who knew him or whatever. And a bunch of those books came out. And then when he was president, a bunch more books came out. And then like COVID happened, I believe a couple books came out about like behind the scenes, what he was doing and thinking. And then when the election happened, some books came out talking about some shit or whatever. And when I say came out, I mean like a year later or something like that. And then since the impeachment shit, January 6th, the election crap, coronavirus, but especially since January 6th, there has been a slew of Trump books coming out um, by all, di all these different reporters talking about shit that they heard and shit that they learned. But then, like, what I don't understand, if you're a reporter and you're a journalist and you're writing these books, obviously, I know you're writing them to cash in and make some fucking money. But where does journalistic integrity come in to where you're keeping vital information from the public for months sometimes years just so you can have like a gotcha moment in your book. Like where does journalistic integrity come into play? And then if it's not a journalist who's doing this, like, do you have, I guess you don't have like a, a moral or ethical, ethical duty to society to fucking spill shit when it happens. I don't fucking know. Like, I, it seems weird to me. The only book... I haven't read any of these books because, like, I just don't give a shit enough. And if you watch the fucking news, they'll tell you all the fucking humdingers in it because everything else is shit you already knew. But the only book that I'm going to, like, give a pass on is, um, like, it was, like, last week or the week before or something, some dude who was in the DOJ that Trump fired... Um, he wrote a book, but he waited because he needed the DOJ to clear it because he wasn't about to like share shit that he shouldn't share. So I'm going to give that motherfucker some credit because like, at least he did his little due diligence there and did the bureaucracy chain of command, red tape and crap. But what do you guys think about this? Do you guys read these fucking books? Like, do you think it's okay for a journalist to withhold vital fucking information just so they could sell a fucking book? I don't know. Let me know down below before I go. Los Angeles, pick it up. I have some big fucking news about October that might blow your mind and you might just be, Jesus fucking Christ, dude, fuck off. Um, so e either way, like there will be some news coming. So I will talk to you guys soon. Take care. I just want to give a quick thanks to those people who make these videos possible. Anarchy Crew and my followers on Patreon, I appreciate the hell out of you guys and thank you so much for keeping me going to keep this content possible. You guys are awesome. And if you'd like to join the crew or the Anarchy Crew, just hit the join button beneath this video. And if you'd like to become a member of my Patreon, you can run over to the link down below to do that as well. Thank you.